Modified Pomodoro Technique for Studies The Modified Pomodoro Technique is as simple as it is effective, You need a stopwatch or you can also use smartphone as a timer. Break your work into more manageable 50 minute chunks during which you work totally uninterrupted. Once the timer rings, take a 10 minute break to relax, drink a glass of water, or move around a little after your break, you'll be refreshed and ready for your next Pomodoro. You must take a break after your Pomodoro, breaks are not optional. Let me explain with an example. Suppose you are a medical student studying in first year, you will have to study three subjects, anatomy, physiology, biochemistry. Usually you get 8 hours time, from 4 pm to 12 am. Now you can schedule your time like this. After few days, you can cut down other activities and add up one more Pomodoro. If you are unable to do any Pomodoro, you can schedule it to weekends or holidays. If you finish early, don't end the Pomodoro, don't start your break, and don't even think about checking your phone before the 50 minutes are over. Just review your work and recap what you've done to retain it in your memory. Important advice, don't get caught in a web of distractions. If you are in the middle of Pomodoro, and your friends want to chat with you about the game last night or any trivial issues, simply politely yet firmly tell them that you'll get back to them shortly. Personal relationships are important, but allowing these sorts of interruptions will simply cascade into another wasted day where nothing gets done. Important instructions, if possible put your phone on flight mode or silent mode. Inform parents to call at a particular time. Turn off notifications. If someone comes by to say hello, they're to be met with a friendly, but firm goodbye. You may only interrupt your Pomodoro in case of real emergencies, if someone tries to interrupt you, then a response like I'm in the middle of a Pomodoro and will call you back, or just 10 minutes, then I can help you are perfectly appropriate. You'd be surprised, but most people will understand and even respect your desire to stay focused. Except maybe not the pizza delivery boy, which is why you shouldn't have ordered pizza in the first place. Facts to remember, remember that there are hidden enemies lurking, waiting to disrupt your productivity if you don't actively protect your Pomodoro. These enemies are interruptions, means, anything that takes your focus away from the task at hand and shifts it to something else. Examples, phone calls temptation to check notifications such as WhatsApp or Facebook every few minutes, urge to browse internet or to watch random videos in YouTube, friends. These interruptions are not only a nuisance, but they also contribute to reduced productivity and those terrible feelings of guilt and frustration that come with them. So, do you know something else about this technique? If yes then tell us in the comment section. If you like this video then hit the like button and share this video with your friends. And one more thing, don't forget to, subscribe.